having a large number of clinical trials available is really good news for patients. Clinical trials are a, a real driver for improvement in treatment quality and, and, and allows there to be a high standard of general care. Additionally, having trials means that patients taking part are often having access to the newest treatments, to new developments. And there's data in the literature suggesting that patients who go into clinical trials on general do better than patients outside trials. The NCRI have been critical to the development and the expansion of clinical trials in the UK. Um, since its inception, the number of trials available for patients, the number of patients going into clinical trials has expanded uh, considerably. And this has been through development of a framework and a network of clinical trial active people. And it's it allowed clinical trials to go beyond the academic centres into the local hospitals and across the country. So it actually means that the trials are widely available to patients across the country. Without the infrastructure provided by NCRI, this wouldn't be possible. It means that the UK is the envy of the world in terms of clinical trial recruitment, with recruitment rates well above the international average. There's numerous examples of where the NCRI framework has led to world leading and practice changing uh, developments for patients. A classic example would be the Stampede trial. This trial, due to the influence of the NCRI, has recruited over 10,000 patients over the last 10 to 15 years. I think this is an achievement. It's almost certainly the largest international trial uh, that's been developed, certainly in the academic setting.